How to hide a malicious document from any popular antivirus? Hi hackers! Cyber criminals often face the fact that they need to send a malicious document. They mainly use two strategies – macros or exploitation of vulnerabilities. You can create a macro using various GitHub scripts, write it yourself or with other tools. However, using all known tools, a document with a macro is detected by almost all antiviruses. But the question concerns us from a security point of view. We are not black hackers. At the Black Hat Asia conference, experts from Outflank showed how the undocumented capabilities of macro make it possible to bypass antivirus protection. They created Evil Clippy, a tool that includes the basic techniques for creating infected files. It manipulates Microsoft Office 2003 and 2007 file formats. With the help of the Evil Clippy, experts have bypassed most antiviruses. For the test, they took Cobalt Strike VBA, a macro that almost all antiviruses find. After applying Evil Clippy, most antiviruses failed this task. First, we need to create a Word document with a macro. Let's generate it using the FatRat tool. It can be used for post-exploitation, to create backdoors and to bypass antiviruses. But we will create a document with a macro. Choose the seventh point, then second, enter our data, file name, text in the document, for example, take the launch calculator, enter the path to the exe file, next select the payload, and that's all. The document with the macro is ready. Now we come to the evil clippy. Installation is quite simple. All comments you can find on GitHub. There are several different functions in evil clippy. The first is to hide the macro in a graphical editor. The second function can replace the malicious macro with a fake innocent code. But the malicious macro will be executed and hidden as a pseudo code. This is such a security loophole due to undocumented capabilities of Microsoft Office. But only to use this feature, you must specify the version of the target Office. Evil Clippy has a built in function that will help you with this. And the last function helps to hide the macro from the various document analysis tools. We will use the second function. Type the comment and the document is ready. Now let's check how many antiviruses detect our file before and after cleaning in Evil Clippy. The document generated in the fat rat is being detected by 9 antivirus programs. The second document after Evil Clip B is seen only by two unknown antiviruses. Thank you for watching, see you in the next video.